Hey everyone, today we are going to learn that how to convert infix expression into prefix. When we discuss about infix to postfix conversion, we discuss some of the rules. Okay, so first let's see what is meant by infix and what is prefix. If the operator comes in between the operand, then that type of expression is called as a infix expression. And if the operator comes before operand, then this type of expression is called as a prefix expression. We already discussed about this in the previous lecture. So the infix expression means when the operator is in between the operand and prefix means when the operator comes before operand then that type of expression is called as a prefix. So in this lecture we are going to learn that how to convert the infix expression into the prefix. So in the previous lecture when we discuss about infix to postfix conversion we discuss some of the rules. That rules are same when we solve the infix to prefix. But only one rule we have to change and that is two operators of the same priority can stay together in stack. In infix to postfix conversion there is a one rule that is no two operators of the same priority can stay together in stack. For example, if there are two operators for example multiplication and division. So both the operators cannot stay together in stack while converting infix to postfix. In this type of conversion that is when we convert infix to prefix then the two operators of same priority can stay together in stack. So the same priority operators are multiplication division and plus minus. So the same priority operator can stay together in stack when we convert from infix to prefix. Okay let's see first example. The example is a into b plus c divided by d. So this is an infix expression and we have to convert it into prefix. When we convert infix expression into prefix, we have to first reverse the expression. Then we have to solve the expression. We have to solve it and third the answer, the final answer we are again going to reverse it. So while converting infix to postfix expression, we have to do these three steps. The given expression we have to reverse it. Then we solve that expression and when we get final answer we have to again reverse it and then we get our prefix expression. Okay, let's solve the above expression. First of all, let's reverse this expression. So when we reverse the above expression, it becomes d divided by c plus b into a. We have to just start from the right and up to the first symbol. So the reverse expression is d divided by c plus b multiplied by a. Now solve the above expression. Okay, let's start scanning from the first symbol. The first symbol is d. If the operand comes, it goes into prefix expression and if operator comes, it goes into the stack. So d is an operand, so it goes into the prefix expression. The second one is a division. Division is an operator, it goes into stack. d is as it is, prefix expression is as it is. The next symbol is C. C is an operand so it goes into prefix expression. The next one is a plus. Now here in our stack division is already there and if we insert plus then the rule says that the low priority operator cannot stay above the high priority operator means in stack we already have division and if we insert plus here then the rule says that the low priority operator cannot stay above the high priority operator. So in order to insert plus into the stack we have to remove division first. Then only we are going to able to insert plus into the stack. Here we have to remove division first in order to insert plus into the stack because the low priority operator cannot stay above the high priority operator. The high priority operator can stay above low priority operator there is no any problem but the low priority operator cannot stay above the high priority operator. Okay, the next symbol is a B. Okay, so here is a plus as it is and B is an operand so it goes into the postfix expression. The next symbol is multiplication. Okay, here is already plus and it comes the multiplication and here we have DC divided by B. Then it comes A. Okay, A is an operand so it goes into the postfix expression. So the expression is 
dc divided by b a okay now we reach the end of the expression and we have two operators remaining in our stack the first one is a plus and then we have multiplication so we are going to remove the topmost operator first and then the plus so the answer is dc divided by b a multiplication plus now this is a postfix expression we have to reverse it so the reverse of the expression is plus multiplication a b divided by c d so this is a prefix expression of our infix expression i hope you understand let's solve another example okay the next example given as left parenthesis a plus again left parenthesis b into c right parenthesis exponential d and again right parenthesis okay when we reverse the expression the left parenthesis is converted into the right and the right parenthesis is converted into left okay so this basic term you have to remember now let's reverse the above expression so the reverse is here the right parenthesis is converted into left then there is a d exponential here is a right parenthesis which is converted into left c multiply by b again there is a left parenthesis which is converted into right plus a again there is a left parenthesis which is converted into right so this is a reverse of above expression now let's solve the above expression so there are three columns first one is a symbol then stack and then expression we are going to scan the symbols the first one is a left parenthesis it goes into the stack the second one is a d d is an operand so it goes into prefix expression then there is an exponential operator so it goes into the stack and here is a d as it is the next one is again left parenthesis so it goes into the stack and here is a d the next one is a c so c is an operand so it goes into the prefix expression then there is a multiplication multiplication is an operator it goes into the stack and here is a, as it is then the next one is a b b is again an operand stack is as it is and here is d c and b b goes into the prefix expression now there comes the right parenthesis okay so here is in our stack we have left parenthesis exponential left parenthesis multiplication and right parenthesis and here we have d c b now multiplication comes in between left and right parenthesis so it get cancel and inserted into the prefix expression now we have plus okay so we already have left parenthesis and exponential in our stack if we insert plus here then the rule applies that is the low priority operator cannot be placed above the high priority operator so in order to insert plus into the stack we have to pop exponential operator so here d c b multiplication exponential and here we have left parenthesis and plus okay the next one is a a is an operand so it directly goes into the prefix expression and that is dcb multiplication exponential a okay uh, the next one is a right parenthesis so it goes into the stack and our expression is dcb multiplication exponential a now plus comes in between the left and right parenthesis so it get cancel and place into the prefix expression okay so this is our answer now i am going to again reverse it so the reverse of above expression is plus a exponential multiplication b c d so this is our prefix expression for the above infix expression